Cam Bedondi reporting for the Infowars Nightly News. On this podium right behind me, the state of Rhode Island is about to crown its first ever female governor, Gina Raimondo, who also happens to be the state's general treasurer. She has lost $372 million out of the pension fund. She's a member of the communist group, the Council on Foreign Relations, the CFR. She's also a gun grabber. She was backed by both Obamas and both Clintons and had endorsements from the Pope. So it's got to be pretty interesting to see what kind of tyranny unfolds in the state of Rhode Island within the next four years. Hi, ma'am. How are you? I'm well, thank you. How are you? Great. And are you here to support Gina Raimondo? Uh, yes, I am. Yes, I am. I am. She's a wonderful person, and I think she's going to do a very, very good job. Absolutely. Okay, and are you support her gun control policy? Uh, the gun control policy. Well... Um, I'll have to pass on that one, you know what I mean, as far as that goes, you know, her policy on that. Um, well, you know, I'd have to really take a look at them. She's sterner with the gun, gun control, which is a positive. I think that gun control really needs to, really needs a fresh look at the amendment and uh, how it affects society and how it's a kind of a breach of our civil liberties to support it in the wrong way. I think it's good, yeah. We need to get more guns off the street, definitely. Do you know who the CFR is? I do not. The Council on Foreign Relations, it was a communist group backed by David Rockefeller? Um, no, no I'm not. It's a communist organization by David Rockefeller and uh, Gina Raimondo is a registered member? N nope, never, never heard of it and uh, like I said, I'm not really here for politics. I didn't know that, no I didn't know that, but I, you know, I have no comment on it. I, I know her since she started running and I think she's on the right path and going to do very good. Okay. Uh, am I aware that there are communist organizations? Well, of course there are. Okay, Communism is a long time off from here, isn't it? Are you were also aware that, uh, about the $372 million missing out of the pension fund? Uh, what are your thoughts about that? Is that a, just a scandal? Uh, I think I, I want to uh, end this. All right, thank you. Yeah, no problem. Now, we're going to have to give up a little of our own narrow self-interest and give something back to our community. But that's how America works. Hey, Governor, could you tell us your your involvement in the CFR, please? Mrs. Raimondo. Mrs. Raimondo, could you tell us your involvement? Hi, Governor, what's your involvement with the CFR? Hi, we're going to go down this way. Do you know it's a communist organization? Governor, what's your involvement with the Council on Foreign Relations? The public wants to know. So he support communism right here in the state of Rhode Island. See, the governor refuses to answer the question. They got two Gestapo cops over here blocking my way with their classic one-on-one -on -one psychology skills here. You gentlemen familiar who the CFR is? The Council on Foreign Relations, it's a communist organization started by David Rockefeller. Gina Raimondo is a registered member, sir. See, so Gina Raimondo's campaign manager. Are you a member of the CFR like Gina? Mr. Hayes, how does it feel to support a communist? How does it feel to support a communist? Very good, Steve. No, I'm just asking questions. So why are you going to be into the question, sir? Uh, who said? Huh? Oh. Yeah, well, it's the. Why don't you stay right here, okay? No, it's the First Amendment. He's been on my team since day one. I understand that, but just not in there. I have a right to be in there. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. It's called the First Amendment. It's the First Amendment in the Constitution. I, I got you. But I've been told, you know, it's a lot of people in there, so. So the staff told you. Well, according to this officer here, the staff of the governor said I can't go into the room. So the press is denied access. Sir, who's in charge? Of security? No, I mean, I know they told you to give you an order from the Lamina, but who's in charge? Because that's, that's a viol I'm part of the press and it's a violation of the First Amendment. Regardless of what Eric Hire says, he's not the boss. Who can I talk to? Who's in charge here? Sir, do you just get in line and go right to the receiving line like everybody else? No, I mean no that problem, okay?